separation of solids from liquid is called clarification. The clarification principle is explained by considering an oil settling tank. Oil containing solid impurities and water is transferred to the tank and allowed to stand undisturbed. Over a period, due to gravitational force, the solid impurities and water will settle down, being heavier than oil. The clean oil will be at the top. However, separation by gravity will require longer time. If centrifugal force is imparted to the oil, then the separation force will be higher, and hence the speed of separation will be faster. In a centrifugal clarifier, the oil is supplied through the distributor to the conical disc stack. Solid impurities present in the oil separate out and accumulate at the bowl side. The heavier solids deposit near the bottom of the bowl and the lighter solids towards the top. Only the clarified oil is delivered out of the clarifier. The separated solid impurities and water are removed through the sludge ports during desludging. Purification is a process of separating two liquids, usually oil and water. The separation of solid impurities also takes place at the same time. Consider a tank with a partition at one end. The partition has an opening at the bottom which allows the liquid to flow through. Water is filled first inside the tank till it overflows from B. Oil is supplied to the tank at A. The oil will displace part of the water and the amount of water displaced will depend on the relative density of the oil. The oil-water interface will depend on the position of B, that is H1 head of water, H2 head of oil and the oil density. The equilibrium equation is H1 is equal to the product of H2 and oil density. The position of the oil-water interface should be maintained to avoid oil mixing with the separated water and water mixing with the clean oil. The position of the interface can be maintained by varying the head of water H1 according to the density of oil being purified. Water present in the oil will settle down, causing an equal amount of water to overflow at B. The quantity of water forming the seal remains constant. The separated clean oil will overflow at C. Rotate the tank through 90 degrees and the figure will represent the separation taking place in a centrifugal separator. The principle is similar to the gravitational method. Water is filled first till water flows out at B. Oil is supplied at A and part of the water is displaced at B. The separated water will flow out at B. The separated clean oil will flow at C. H1 is altered depending on the density of the fuel to maintain the oil-water interface. In centrifugal purifier, gravity disk controls the position of oil-water interface. The size of the gravity disk is selected according to the density of the oil to be purified from the maker's nomogram. The purifier is filled with sealing water first. The oil to be purified flows down the distributor and enters the conical disc stack through the supply holes. Part of the water is displaced and the remaining water forms the water seal. The oil flows in between the discs through the distribution holes and the heavier solid impurities separate and accumulate at the bowl side. The separated water from the oil flows out through the water outlet. The purified oil flows out to the oil tank. Purifiers separate liquids as well as solid impurities. Clarifiers separate only solid impurities. Purifiers have separate outlets for the separated water and the purified oil. Only clarified oil is discharged from the clarifier. The gravity disk in the purifier 
maintains the oil water interface.